few steps for an effective backhand slice. First step, the preparation. Create potential energy. Your elbow should be bent sideways. Your wrist should be bent upward. And your non-dominant hand should be holding the neck of the racket. Position your racket head up, slightly above the ball. While your shoulder should be pointing towards the ball. Second step, the contact point. Weight transfer. Strike the ball with an up to down motion. Extend your wrist and forearm at contact. And don't forget to move forward. Notice how Cameron Norrie executes all the key points precisely. In my opinion, he's one of the best slices in the game. He doesn't just use it as a defensive tool, but also to change the pace of the game. Norrie's forehand is much better than his backhand, and he uses his slice so he can get more balls on his forehand. His opponent is forced to hit a slower and higher ball, which gives him time to move to his forehand. Most of the time, Nori is stuck with a backhand battle, he hits his slice down the line so he can get space and open up with his forehand. What about you? How do you like to use your slice during the matches? Do you use it defensively or strategically? Thanks for watching.